Act after an inv investigation uncovered racial slurs were spoken to rival students attending a football game in Orange County. Now, students from San Diego made those accusations following that game at San Clemente High School. Now, that school's principal has sent a letter spelling out everything that was discovered and what they're planning to do now. And CBS2 Orange County reporter Michelle Gili is live at San Clemente High School with how students from both campuses are reacting today. Michelle? Well, Pat, in the principal's letter, he said that students from Lincoln High School said that they were called racial slurs at the football game here at San Clemente High School, both in the bathroom and near the snack bar. The principal's name is Chris Carter, and in that letter, he says he regrets the pain that this caused those students and their school community. So next on the agenda is bias training. I feel kind of disgusted because that's not a part of our school. After a week of investigating, San Clemente High's principal has apologized on behalf of his school community for racial slurs and derogatory words used against students and fans from San Diego's Lincoln High School. The incidents happened on September 13th during a home game. Touchdown. Lillian Mixon represents her school as a majorette. She says she was called the N-word. And when the school statement came out, I was like, okay, this is this is good because they're confirming that this actually happened. It felt good to know that I had the support of my family, of my school, of other people, of people in the San Clemente community. Capistrano Unified School District officials forwarded Principal Chris Carter's letter, which in part says, based on our extensive investigation, we were able to confirm that two individuals in the restroom used a racial epithet when addressing a Lincoln High School student. In addition, statements we collected confirmed that derogatory words were heard in our bleachers. The district says no video evidence was collected, which could help identify the offenders. Students on both campuses will participate in a one-day workshop with the Anti-Defamation League. I think um, telling kids, like um, educating kids on the situation is always a good idea because... It's, it's not okay in my opinion, and I think if we're more educated about it, we may, more kids will make better decisions. Now, no one is being disciplined at this point. In the principal's letter, he said that the goal is to make this school behind me here a welcoming and inclusive place for everyone. That's the latest live in San Clemente. I'm Michelle Geely.